Lala Camille, how'd you get that stage name? Um, I don't know. Actually, like, when I was meeting my agent and stuff, it, we kind of just, like, made it up. Just made it up? Yeah, like, I've always wanted the name Camille. Mm-hmm. Or I've always, like, if I have a daughter, I'm going to name her Camille and stuff. And then, like, some people, like, call me Lala. Because the only famous Lala I know is from a, she's married to a, that basketball player. Right, Carmella. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right, so how did you make the transition from porn into what you were doing before? Which was... So, you're saying from modeling? No, no, we, we spoke about modeling before earlier, yeah, but I'm so talking about like when you worked at, where was it, Walmart? Walmart. Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> I worked at a lot of places. I worked at Walmart, I worked at McDonald's, I worked at Steak and Shake. Did you ever get those asshole customers? Like, yeah. you do the minute they walked in the door? Yes. Tell us. Well, actually, like, at Steak and Shake, I was um, doing drive through Mm-hmm. And, like, this lady had came through, but, like, it was just, like, so broken down. The whole place was basically broken down. Like, the headsets were messed up, mm-hmm. like, the speakers, everything. So when someone would come through the drive through we wouldn't be able to hear their order. Mm-hmm. So we're both, but basically we're both yelling at each other through the speaker, trying mm-hmm. to, like, understand the order. Mm-hmm. And so this one lady comes into the window, and she's just going off, and she's, like, I don't know. She's just, like, having an attitude because I couldn't hear her. And mm-hmm. I was just like, whatever, because, you know, I didn't really care. I was, like, planning on quitting. So, like, she was just having, like, a crazy attitude. And then, like, she, when I was giving her her change, she had her fingers, like, spread wide open, so they, like, fell right through. Oh, and wow. so she was just like, go get your manager, da, da, da. And so, like, I got my manager, and she was just telling her, like, I could beat her ass and all this stuff, trying to, like, fight me. Customer is threatening you. Yeah. Okay. And I'm just sitting there, like, it is what it is. Now the time, the whole time you were doing that, were you thinking, "Oh my God, porn might be the answer"? What was <laughs> no. porn the last thing on your mind? I didn't ever, honestly. I is still unrealistic to me to even know that I'm doing that right now. Are you kind of in the shock phase, like? Mm-hmm. Yeah, like I'm shocked that I'm even doing this because I never picked. Like this never even crossed my mind to do. Mm-hmm. You know, like I thought about stripping and things like that. You know, but I've never like thought of something like this. Well, porn is just a heartbeat away from stripping. Yeah. You have any good stripper stories? Oh, you never did it? No, I never did it. Never did it, okay. Yeah. All right, ready to do this for Dog Fart? Yeah. Let's get Chad in here.